Hello, it's me, your local witch Daphne, <laughs> back with another video. So, since I'm a witch, I'll do a spell on you to make you watch all the way to the end. <laughs> Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be going to Dollar Tree to see if they have any more Halloween stuff. I'm sure they have some things, but I'm late in the game, so I'm gonna see what they have and see if I can pick up a few things, like crafting things to do with my kids. Say hi, Craig. Ow! Okay. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. So, let's put my hair forward. Dollar Tree, say Dollar Tree. Good Dollar Tree. You want Dollar Tree? You? I think it's Target. You, we were going to Dollar Tree first to record and then to Target. We talked about this already. Let's, let's go. Seatbelts first. Look where we're at. Dollar Tree is for me. Dollar Tree is for me. Trick or treat. I've been here so many times I should have recorded, but I didn't. Have some of these spider webs and these little what are these tombstones? Craig will not be having that. That's the garlands, eyeballs. I have to do something cute for the kids. Cause they're like, why don't we decorate for Halloween? Cause daddy ain't into that. I want some pumpkins. Well, let's see what we got. Some more garlands. Some trees. And we have a little tombstone. Cute. Gigantic eyes. More stickers. Oh, look at these eyes. Giant eyeballs just staring at you. There's two of them. Got some bones. Chains and Christmas. This is cute. You could actually have your kids paint them. Get creative. And this, let's see, has a light. It's cute. Skeleton bird that Craig will not have. And of course you have candy. And more candy. And then we got some fall decor. These are so cute. Some wooden stickers. Some pumpkins with burlap on it. That's cute.
of pumpkin cutters. Of sticky eyeballs. Cute little treats for like the kids. If you wanna make them treat bags, I might make my kids some treat bags. A little crafting project. things to put in treat bags pencils I think these are the little pack of yeah these are little balloons they're cute they have them for Valentine's Day too you just hit them and they open up and there comes a balloon yeah They got some glow in the dark bats. These boxes are so cute. You could put like candy in them, get a party, make this a giveaway treat box. It says look inside. This is what's inside. Cute. We got more candy. Okay, let's look at this section. Cause this section you need to get very creative with and create costumes. For the boys, you could Definitely put them in like all black and make them a warrior. They have the chest shield, the mask, and this probably goes to their arm. Make them a little warrior. Look how cute that is. That is really nice. I think I'm gonna make my daughter a witch this year. This is cute. Let's, let's just get one. They have this if you have um, Ninja Turtles or Ninjas. So that's pretty much it for Halloween. I'm going to go look around and check out. Yeah, because I only came here for Halloween stuff. So that's what I'm gonna do. Thanks for letting me use your back as a rest. <laughs> Another Halloween spot. These are cute. These are like the chains. The, what's those things they called? Like the little fence. You buy a few of them and make a little fence. Cute, cute, cute. So we are done with Dollar Tree. We actually went to um, the grocery store because Craig wants to make me a grilled cheese sandwich that he saw our on a food show but yeah so he we went to the supermarket to go get some cheese and stuff because it's like some special grilled cheese that looks delicious he wants to try to make it um i picked up some things from there craig would say too many things from there i will go home 
and show you everything I bought. So guys, as you can see, I got a pumpkin. It's a pumpkin. It is a styrofoam pumpkin for $1, not bad. So I got an orange bucket, which wasn't in the Halloween section, but I decided to get it because it was orange and see what I could do with it. Next I got, which this was actually the first thing I grabbed, was the um, spider veil with the spiders. We could actually do this on a bush outside. We got a hat. Let's lift this up for you guys to see. It's a hat right here. Mm -hmm. And I figured I got this for Leilani. Maybe she'll be a witch. I could just DIY the rest of her stuff. And for a dollar, a witch hat that is super cute. Not a bad deal at all. I found some chalk paint, not really um, Halloweenish, but it's black, so you could kind of make it Halloweenish. Flower time. We got the flower time. I bought flowers. Fall colored flowers. Aren't they pretty? We got these flowers, which are really cute, with burlap and flower. Nice. We got these pink flowers, which are like pink and purple, which I thought put a pop of color in it. Cute. Of course, we got orange sunflower looking thingy majiggies. Yeah. And then we got these cute ones, which are also burlap. Um, well, they have burlap on it, which is nice. Then we got this one that I found last minute, and I decided to get two of them because the color is just so me. And even for after the holiday, I could just like make some kind of arrangement to put around. And then I have this flower, just regular. Sometimes you see them in people's gardens. I kind of got into this already, but I bought some lemon heads in the Halloween section. Some lemon heads, my favorite. Let's show you this stuff. So I bought a burlap pumpkin, which is so cute for fall, Halloween, this season, basically. It is really cute. Cute. And then I bought, hold on, let's get the other one. I bought another burlap. So I have two burlap mini pumpkins, which are cute. I got this here, which is too cute. Trick or treat. Then I got some more paintbrushes right here. Then these are like too cute for fall or for Halloween. They are like wooden um, stickers. They are DIY wooden stickers. You could paint them. You could leave them just like this, which would be really cute. You can write on them. You could even use it if you're having a fall wedding because they have the leaves and maybe you want to throw a pumpkin. Hey, you never know. So I bought two of those because I have some projects to do with this and the flowers. If you find these, buy these. Even if you don't need them this year, you might want them next year. And what else? This guy. I showed you him already, which is super cute. Let's let's play him. Trick or treat, smell my feet, give me something good to eat. I lost the flower. But anyway, then I bought these guys, which are too cute. I noticed that this one is actually like dirtyish, but I'll clean that. I plan on decorating the outside, fall inspired, and then. These guys are must-haves. Metal words, which say thankful, harvest, and welcome, which are too cute. I should have bought two of them, but they were like legit. They're good. We have welcome. Super cute, right? Yeah, super cute. Then we have harvest. Oop. And then we have thankful, which you could put these and just like leave them on something or I don't know, something. I couldn't pass it up. They're cute. Now for my aesthetically pleasing look of stuff. Let's just quickly end this. So there we go. These are the things that I got from Dollar Tree today. And doesn't this look like really nice? And all I did was put things together in like two seconds. Still has tags. But yeah, we have the welcome, thankful harvest. Do a little setup like this and it'll be cute. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this Dollar Tree 
haul and shop with me if you did don't forget to leave it a like also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press that bell notification for you can see every time or not see but no get notified every time i post a video again thank you very much have a nice day have a nice night have a nice time yeah bye guys <laughs>